So in the spirit of Valentine's Day being tomorrow, we're talking plants for the occasion. If you want to avoid going the standard rose route, Dave, you've got one option with rose in the name, but not actually a rose. Exactly. And, and, and you know, it's just thinking of all the fun things we could talk about with this. So I've got two plants here. This is a, a hellebore. These are one of my favorite early spring perennials. This is an outdoor plant. You can enjoy it inside and then plant it once the, uh, you know, the ground thaws out. It's, the variety of the hellebore is ice and roses red. And it's just beautiful. And, of course, ice. I mean, we've got ice out there, roses, Valentine's Day. And here you go, uh, wonderful flowers. Eventually, as the flowers fade, uh, they, they remain, the sepals remain on the back of it. And you can see uh, the flowers even well into April, May, even June. The foliage is also really beautiful with this dark green. And here's the other bonus for you folks in the burbs. It's deer resistant. We love that because the deer are rampant all over the place. Now, if you're not an outdoor gardener and maybe you're in the city and you want something really cool, this is from a time when you didn't have to worry about your Valentine because we were all living in caves. Uh, this is a sago palm. This is a cycad. And it's a very old plant. It's very forgiving. Forgiving, like, you know, you should be with your sweetheart. And uh, the plant can live in almost any room in the house. It obviously needs some light. But it, it again, it's, it's just a really nice little plant. It can be bonsai. Or what I do with mine, I have a bigger one that I've had for a long time. I move it outside in the summer, inside in the winter. And the foliage, similar to this, nice and shiny and green. And uh, just two great plants, indoor and outdoor. Nick? All right, I'm really going to have to look into that one and, and emphasize the forgiving part when uh, yeah, I admit that I have yet to purchase any sort of Valentine's Day gifts yet. So time to get to work on that. We'll start there, Better, Dave. Much appreciated. All right, very good. Time ticking here. It's